Leland Vittert, are you there? Please give him some space and yeah, back I am, up. I am, sure, but we're live on television right now. I have, a, I have an officer saying that no one was shot. Nobody was shot. How are you sure about that? Because we have no shooting victim right now. So there's so there's no gunshot wounds? Custody. There's no gunshot wounds reported at this time, no. Okay. Why do witnesses say there was a gunshot wound? I think wound? it was just a misperception in the community that, that stemmed out. So, okay. And I, we will have our PIO piece talk to you guys and brief you in one second. I just want to make sure the community understands because they're upset that nobody was shot. Okay? Are you worried about how big this crowd is no, getting? Stop it. No, Ooh. we're not. We're, we're fine right now. I didn't right mean now. for that to be on All TV. Right? Sorry. I, I just mean, come on, come on back to the set now. It, it sounds to me like what's happened is um, what's happened is we screwed up, what it sounds like. Um, I, I can tell you one thing, Mike Tobin would, would never, I've been through this. Uh, Mike Tobin thought he saw somebody get shot. And there was a gun, and there was a patient on a stretcher, and there was a woman who said she saw the cops gun him down, and there's going to be violence and all the rest of that. And what we have is nothing. And the truth is, according to police, there is no gunshot victim. The person who fell in the street there is being taken to hospital because the person, I assume, went down, went down on the street after dropping the weapon. Um, these are not normal environs <laughs> to most people. Uh, places where there are transactions on the street, as the woman put it, uh, that's, not, that's not how everybody lives every moment of every day. Uh, that's not how Mike Tobin lives. And that's not how Leland Vittert lives, and that's not how our security guard lives. But from everything we've learned uh, from that scene over the past weeks, that's part of life there. And that's, that's part of the problem there. And a bunch of people who were trained at this sort of thing saw it, and it wasn't real. And now something has been created there that is wrong and unnecessary. Uh, we were wrong. Our people on scene were wrong. Theirs was an error uh, that was honest and straightforward and our duty as journalists is not to make mistakes and when we make mistakes we are duty bound to correct them immediately and as clearly as possible so I'm now in correction mode and we apparently were wrong unless there's new information that comes forward all the information now points to there was a guy running down the street guy had a gun according to police gun fell in the street gun went off a uh, guy was taken into custody he complained that he was injured or something. They put him in an ambulance. And out of an abundance of caution, the police are now telling us, they took him to the hospital. Nobody has been shot. No police officer has pulled the trigger. And on behalf of Mike Tobin and the rest of our crew there and the rest of us at Fox News, I am very sorry for the error and glad we were able to correct it quickly. The news continues after this.